Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So season 7 is now out for a few days, I played around 4 to 5 hours and I just wanted to give my first impressions of the season, what do I think about it, how does it play, especially with all the changes they made, but yeah. Let's start with the map first and I'm very split on the map. I think when it comes to like the visuals of the map, the destruction of the map, the map is actually great. It feels like a real battlefield map, especially with all the houses you can basically level to the ground and stuff. But when it comes to actually playing the map, I think the map plays really bad and I'm not really sure if that's because of the general design of the map or more of the battlefield player base. The problem with the map is since it's an urban map with a lot of houses. There are a lot of opportunities for people to just camp in windows, camp at stairwells and basically your round is very dependent on do you get an enemy team that likes to move around and push objectives or do you get an enemy team that just sits in a corner of the room or is just looking out of the windows and so your experience widely varies especially for me i had some rounds where i actually had a lot of fun everybody was moving the map played really well and i also had a lot of rounds where the enemy team was just sitting in windows shooting you the moment you try to cross the street without a smoke grenade so yeah i'm very split on the map and i also think i don't know if it's just a me problem but i think the visibility on the new map is really bad and i'm not sure if it's generally Generally that the visibility is bad in 2042 since I played so much redacted and unredacted you can clearly see everybody but on a new map I find it very hard to spot people even if they are right in the open and especially when they are sitting in a window and I don't know what the reason for this is but I think because the map is so bright and the uh, houses are generally very dark inside that you don't really see enemies very well behind windows but yeah overall I think the map is good looking and could play good but I think the problem is really the bad <laughs> player base this time around as to how they play and one last thing to the map i also think the map is kind of unbalanced i had quite a lot of rounds actually almost every round i played it's either you completely stomped the enemy team or the enemy team completely stomps you i think i had not a single game where the winning team had less than like 300 to 400 tickets more than it than the team that basically ran out of tickets so that's super unbalanced and i'm not sure if it's a map problem or if it's because matchmaking sucks in 2042 but i think it's more of that matchmaking sucks now another thing they did was the visual recall update and here i have to say i hate it and most people online also hate it first of all some guns are completely unusable stuff like the p90 or stuff like the desert eagle you literally can't shoot them because they jump all over your screen also i heard dmrs are really unplayable and i also read online there are quite a lot of people online that said they get nauseous from all the camera movement and shake they have when firing a gun and even i myself i don't really get nauseous when i play but i noticed that i really have to focus my eyes a lot harder than i had to before when i try to track somebody and this really puts some strain on my eyes so that after like one two maybe three rounds i really need to take a break just to relax my eyes again so i think the visual recall is a miss and also with the visual recall update they actually bug aiming again and has made a video for it i will link it to you in the description please check it out he explains it very well what is happening currently and so i think with the visual recall they either need to tune it down significantly for a lot of guns or what i think would be the better option would to just make it an accessibility setting where players could switch between old visual recall and the new visual recall those people that want more immersion that don't really notice or have any problems with the new visual recall they can just enable the visual recall in the settings and for people that like get nauseous or like me that really hate it and have actually problems because they need to focus their eyes so much they can just turn it off go back to the old visual recall and then everybody is happy but currently if you have problems with the visual recall and you play on pc and your monitor has the option enable a monitor crosser i'm currently playing with one and it helps me a lot because i can just focus on my static dot in the middle of the screen i can still hit my targets and it puts really less strain on my eyes but i also have to say only use a monitor crosser if your monitor is one built in because i think if you download a third party software for a monitor crosser you might get banned for it but i'm not sure and i really wouldn't like want to test it out so if your monitor doesn't have one you're out of luck but yet that's the visual recall and also if you want like a gun that performs very well with the new visual recall go play 
the PBX. It's a super strong SMG, especially with the changes. Or I also think the new battle pass guns, they feel like they actually forgot to add visual recoil to them. So those are the three guns I would advise you to play if you have any problems with the visual recoil or are still looking for a gun that performs well. And now the third thing they changed was actually yeah, the headshot multipliers. And I think they play really well now. SMGs finally feel really good. Also over range and especially in close quarters fights, not because your headshots now matter a lot more. So if this change gunplay feels so much smoother on SMGs while not destroying ARs and LMGs so I'm happy about them. They can keep this change makes the game a lot more fun. And yeah that's basically my first impression. The new map is very dependent on what enemies you play against but overall I don't think the map is like bad but I also don't think the map is super great. A lot of people already want redacted back and I also see myself there. I also want redacted back. Yeah the new visual recall is a complete miss especially what surprises me they already posted on twitter that they heard feedback that some guns are unusable and i'm like why do they need to hear feedback they literally just needed to shoot every gun once before going live with the patch and they would have noticed that stuff like the p90 or the dmrs are unusable and they could have fixed it instantly but this shows me again that dice literally is not testing their patches because you make a big overhaul to weapon recoil two and a half years into the game and then you don't even shoot every gun once to see how it looks like it's just crazy to me but yeah visual recoil please revert it tone it down significantly or just make it an accessibility option then everybody would be happy and then you had more shot multipliers are great and now i would like to hear your opinion what do you think of the season so far what are your first impressions do you enjoy the new visual recall do you enjoy the map how are the guns feeling for you let me know down in the comments below as always if you enjoyed this video consider leaving a like and subscribing for more battlefield content in the future thank you so much for watching until the end and i will see you in the next one